All right. Hey, YouTube, what is up? This is the day two KCON vlog. Let's go. So actually, to my surprise, I didn't really film anything throughout the day of day two, but I will talk about what happened at day two. Day two is when I um, was, again, trying to find my stupid finger hard baseball cap, because the second day we decided not to get up super early because we already checked in and everything. So we got there by like, I think 11 or something, or 12 maybe even. Um, Leah went to her BTS audience fan engagement that she had, and while she did that, I was looking for my hat. And when I went over there, there was a giant line, and I was like, is this the line for the hats? And they're like, yeah, and it's also like, Dre, he's up there. And I was like, no way. <laughs> so I forgot that was the thing that was happening. He was having a little meet and greet at that booth. So I waited in line, I made friends with some people, like this girl in the mall was really chill, a couple other girls, and we were all bonding and jamming and chilling and body rolling while we were waiting in line. <laughs> it was a fun time. And then I got to meet Dre, and I'm really sorry that I like startled you because I was kind of a little excited that I actually was like going up and saying hi to you and like what's good. Um, so, because I got up and I was like, hi, and he was kind of like, hey. <laughs> and, Whew, awkward moments by Michaela. Story of my life. Anyway, so, and I got the um, Juan snapback. It's on my wall over there of hats. That, and he signed it. And then um, I got a picture with him, which is right here. He's super nice, um, super, just like the most humble guy in the world. It's so funny, so like real, chill. I'm sorry I startled you again, <laughs> but it was really cool to see you. I saw him a lot throughout the convention in general, and then also at the pre-party thing, obviously. I was just too shy to say anything, so I didn't say anything. <laughs> You're a cool dude. Cool dude. Big inspiration. Um, to why I'm doing this and everything. So that happened, and then basically me and Leah just kind of like walked around a lot of that day and looked at the booths and stuff, because we didn't really do that the day before. And then we went and got food. Actually, the day before we made friends with this lovely married couple um, in line, and we saw them again that day. They're super sweet. Um, and did, and then we all waited in line, and this giant mob, not even a line, before the concert started, and then we got let in, and I didn't really film anything until the concert started, because I was like, I gotta save um, my camera battery and my memory on my card, because I only brought my one memory card, because I'm stupid. <laughs> Phone battery, and I was like, I'm gonna save it all, because BTS is happening today, and I'm not prepared to see them. Oh my god. So those are the clips that I have for that. Are you having a good time, America? So is he ready for more? Ah, uh, then... It's time to introduce the next crew to get your heart going. Before I Oh, I like this song. Woo! 
shit. <laughs>
let's all promise to have a good time again next year. KCON has brought together Korea and America through K culture. And we want to have an even thank you. Bigger <laughs> show, better show, with more fans, more people, more stars. We're gonna work hard to make that happen for you guys next year. Yes, I feel like we've all made amazing memories here together, so thank you for that. And everyone, I hope we can all have an incredible time again next year. Alright, you guys. Take the way.
Oh my god, okay, that was the craziest fucking thing. We just saw BTS, I can't even, I can't talk right now, they honestly. They did cypher. I can't believe it. Oh my god. I'm about to vlog while going to the bathroom. That's normal, right? Probably not. I'm gonna stop. I'm gonna stop. She got a blanket. KCON was amazing. Leah's napping already. My feet just hurt really bad. Same, same. These are the shoes I wore. Why? I was so scared Why? for you when you were like, I'm gonna fall. I'm jumping. I was like, oh my god, no, please. Because my feet got sweaty and I know, I was like I was sliding like, oh. around. But it's okay. Oh my god. Also, fun fact, so an update. Uh, I bought a KCON t-shirt and I left it in our Uber. So I'm waiting for him to come back and give it to me because I'm an idiot. <laughs> and I feel really bad. We're all supposed to go get cheesecake and stuff soon hopefully if that guy comes with my shirt and in the meantime i'm looking back at all my videos and wanting to cry and i can't believe that just happened oh my god <laughs> a lot of my videos are really bad because a i got a new camera to vlog with obviously the one i'm using and i can't quite figure out why it doesn't autofocus that well so you know and the fact i could not stop jumping and it was i just you know sometimes you just gotta live in the moment Oh, uh, BTS. I hate them so much. BTS! <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Uh, that was so great. Was... Shout out to KCON. That was fun. I hate K-pop. <laughs> it's so good. Oh wait, I forgot. And then we also went outside to watch the like vans leave, which we were like, we're not going to be those people. Security! <laughs> and we started chanting for the security. And we came up with... <laughs> We're the delinquents. We're the delinquents. That's the fan base name for the this security so, staff of the Prudential so Center that we were cheering for while we were waiting for all the buses to leave with people. Can't really see who's on the bus, so it's kind of like, guess who? But why does no one like point a flashlight at the bus? It wouldn't matter. They're tint like they're super tinted windows, so you're not really gonna see. It's more or less if past the parking. It's more or less when they have lights like, in the car. You can see who it is. Oh, because like yesterday. When we did that on accident, on accident we did this yesterday when we went outside and like watched the people leave. But the one bus had I swear it had to be seventeen because in the back someone had like their phone or whatever and it lit up their face and I swear it was Hoshi but I'm not really sure. So that's the thing. Voice is in pain. Obviously, I don't sing at <laughs> BTS. I just scream BTS lyrics. <laughs> okay, this is so much better than Highlight Tour. Also, just throwing that out there. They did Cypher Part 3, so that made my life. And boys with fun. So, I'm just like... Uh, when that beat dropped for Cypher, though, the, the whole... The whole place was like crumbling and oh rumbling. Oh my god, it was lit. It was so lit. So lit. I'm gonna watch my Snap story and see how obnoxious that is. <laughs> I'm sure it's really obnoxious. Also, today, I'm not, I lied, I'm not gonna stop. I bought this hat, but I got the wand symbol hat. Um, and then, ironically, because I went to go buy it, I was wanting the finger heart ones. They don't have them anymore. Um, so I got that one, and I was like, what's this line for? Is it for the, like, hats? And they're like, no, Dre, Dre's having a meet and greet. And I was like, oh my god, I totally forgot. So then I asked to meet Dre, and he signed it. So that's exciting. I also got... Zico Gallery album because I love it so much and I'm so excited because it's fantastic. I didn't really buy much of anything. Leah bought a lot of stuff. I didn't because I was like, I, I don't know. And um, I probably should have got something, but oh well. <laughs> yeah, so that's that. I'm just waiting well, to get my shirt. Oh yeah, Leah got a blanket, the KCON blanket. It's really fun. I still don't know how I feel about these little scratch off things and I'm trying to think of a way to make them better and I can't quite figure that out. Overall it was fun. There's a lot of cool booths there. Um, well I saw three of the YouTuber people I like so that's exciting. I said hi to Hey It's Faye while I was in line for my 17 fan engagement. I was literally standing there and I was like hey it's Faye because I started walking by and then she like turned and like was like and I was like hi <laughs> and she kept walking obviously but because I was in line. So then I like tweeted to her and then all this happened and I'll probably insert the screenshots of that stuff there, maybe. And then I also saw Kenny, Kenny Boy, uh, later and I was really, I just had really awkward encounters with both him and Dre. When I met Dre also, I kind of startled him because I was really excited and he was kind of just like, because <laughs> I was like, hi! And he was like, <laughs> I was like, yes, can you sign this? And he's like, well, yeah. <laughs> and then I asked to get a photo and that happened. 
And then I met Charlie Chu. Yes, and Leah met her um, one of her favorite people. It was a really good panel, the cross cultural one. That was really good. Considering that we were only walking over there to the chairs. Yeah, and then we actually like, started listening. <laughs> okay. and then it turned out to be like, ah, yeah. Yeah, it turned out being really good. So a lot of stuff that we like to talk about, basically. A long, full two days. I feel like the concert is so short, but it's not when you really think about it. It just goes by, I feel like, really fast. Dude, when you go to Korea and I go there, and if we go to Strictly a BTS concert, it'll be like so much better. <laughs> oh my god, do you see that? <laughs> I just respect them so much, and Same. they're just so talented, and their music is good, and Same. it's just like... Ugh. It was cool to talk to Charlie about moving to Korea to teach and stuff. Oh, yeah, that's she was awesome. a really big inspiration for me to do that. I'm only moving to Korea because BT. No, I'm just kidding. I hate people like that. <laughs> no, I'm I actually just really love teaching I kids. Love I think it's really great. Yeah, like I love teaching kids. So I did save my snaps from the second day, the first day of the concert. I forgot to save my snaps, and I'm really upset about it. So all my Snapchat story, um, I saved all those videos, and I'll insert them now. <laughs> Cypher, BTS performed Cypher, everybody. Just a heads up. And what was the fun? What's your like fantastic live? Let me just tell you, I can't feel my feet at all or my. <laughs> the big thing was not even here. Why am I saying them? I don't know. Because I suck. Because it is like a weird. I named an Uber is 
hard. Yeah. Where is it supposed to be at? Well, it comes to us. Oh. So I was gonna call him and tell him. I don't know how this works. <laughs> Good job. The light? Yeah. Oh lord. Okay. What is your diesel look like? Running after our Uber, this is awkward. I don't your car anymore. I thought. <laughs> oh my god, I hate my life. <laughs> that was all of my footage, I think, that I had from the second day, the final day uh, of KCON New York 2016. It was amazing. I wish I could go to LA too because that lineup is also fantastic. Oh my god. Okay, anyways, but I can't do that. I live in Ohio, so <laughs> I'll be waiting till next year. I'm sorry that these vlogs are really long, but I wanted to document it, obviously. If you like this video, please give it a big thumbs up. Um, if you were there or whatever, leave some comments down below. We can chat about, you know, our biases. Who's your favorite group? Did you go to KCON? Blah, blah. I don't know. <laughs> Start a conversation. If you haven't already, click the subscribe button down below to be notified of when I upload a video. I hope you have a beautiful night, even day, whenever you're watching this with your beautiful little eyeballs. And I will see you in the next vlog that I have. Bye!